Hi and Assalamualaikum. Today I would like to show how to do exercise for varying attribute table for at this tutorial. The first step we need to find record containing particular attribute values and then we need to open up map first. From here, click the data and open attribute table and then we click for table option and choose find and replace. And here we find ES359 and then mesh case find next. No record. We also can find ES find next no record on so for this part actually highlight about how to find records by using um find and replace method for the tools and then we proceed to step 2 for selecting records and then for the selecting record method we choose this data so open the attribute and then from the data you can click um, left hand column this one and then you can see this is highlight highlight of the data and then you can see here the part that being selected, the area that being selected, and for clearing the, the selected data, you can click here. So the highlight is not showing anymore, and the second one you also can just click back here. Okay, and then the data is. Clearly remove. The data is clearly removed here. Okay, for step 3, we're gonna do selecting features by attribute. And for this one, I'm gonna use the data from the use. And click for open attribute table. And from here, we can see the data. And then, click select by attribute. And then, this is a pop-up window here. And then, we can see the objective and other name. For example, I choose... Um, ah, before that, there is a symbol that we can see here, like... Um, Greater than, we have less than, and here we have less than or equal to, and then need this one not equal to, and for this one, greater than or equal to, and we have other button here, and for this one, we can uh, randomly choose, for example, I choose name, and then I click, and then equal. I choose or oh, before that name and then get unit values and then I click here again name equal to and I choose randomly um Rio Cordoba and then here okay. and then we can see and the value that we choose is being highlighted in the attribute table. Then we proceed to the last step which is step 4 for multi criteria selection using the, the data from the attribute table and I would like to cancel again I click open attribute table and then I clear this one and then 
select by attribute open this window and then uh, make sure you choose method which is create a new selection and then um, for example i choose name name here oh before that do not double click just click name and then get unit value first and then i choose um, name equal to i choose um this data and n choose rio and then i click apply if you click apply and then you get um a message here which is there was a problem selecting so uh, this is most likely um, an error in the construction of our expression so we need to check the operators that present and which is um, whether it is correctly spaced the field is specified before the each operator okay and then I try again. Uh, select object from Rio. Okay. For my case, um, there's an error problem here that I can apply. That pop up the stable window. So if um the real one will be um we can apply here. So we can successfully apply and then for the attribute table will be whether a highlight one or um, there is not any highlight record depending on uh, which sec section that we view on the attribute table. So uh, this is all the steps that we need to follow for exercise 4. That's all from me. Thank you.